but yeah yo what is up guys so for today we're gonna to be talking about destiny 2 now specifically we're uh, this is basically gonna be the tutorial for how to do transmog for the people who haven't done it yet or don't know how to do it after this video i'm definitely gonna be making the critique video because it's fucking ridiculous but let's get on with it let's just do this real quick because it's not gonna be a long video so first and foremost go to ada she's gonna want you to complete uh, a whole quest step or a quest line just complete the quest line you'll get a free what is it 10 uh 10 materials so that way you can get 10 pieces of armor after that you're gonna be able to actually get some of these bounties the thing that's kind of unfortunate and i'll talk to i'll talk about that later in another video is you'll have a quest which is basically just saying oh get 150 uh synth weave or synth strands uh the black armor. you get synth strands from basic i know it says killing stuff and whatnot but the best way is just to complete uh playlist activities uh this week scorch is up i recommend scorch scorch is super fast it takes like four minutes to complete uh, a match sometimes it's even shorter uh you can do pretty much anything you want uh you i haven't seen any any drop from from kills but it might just not show up in the hud the thing that kind of pisses me off is the fact that it's gonna take you a while it's gonna take you a while like as you guys can see right here uh, i've already completed mine and i already have seasonal hunter bounties completed two out of ten and it took me a while like i literally finished it yesterday and i've been playing like a good 12 13 14 hours of destiny 2 so i just completed one of them yesterday so this is gonna take you a while i know i had 100 on the other one but i had 50 already from before so it's gonna take you a long time uh I'm gonna critique it more in the other video, but essentially Ada will, Proceed. after you're done, get, get your free material. Then after that, you just play the game normally. You'll get synth, synth weave or synth strands eventually. And then after you get that, you spend your synth strand to get uh, whatever bounty you want. I would recommend the Vanguard Threader just because you have to complete at the most like three, unless it's really, like, cause the Vanguard one, will tell you to get a certain like 200,000 200,000 uh points in the nightfall this nightfall you can easily hit 100 in hero mode so unless like your team does really bad and dies a lot like other than that that's going to be the best one i would not recommend uh destination threader because this one you will have to do uh the dreaming city activity which was a pain i had to do like what is it Th two no what is, i don't i think it's 12 i want to say tw you have to complete 12 blind wells but if you complete like a level three with the the extra level at the end then it counts as four but even then doing that is just annoying so you might as well just do vanguard thirder because you'll be getting a chance to get whatever uh exotic or not exotic whatever uh ritual weapon you get from not ritual weapon what the fuck the nightfall weapons whatever nightfall weapon is that week that you're watching this video you'll be able to get that you'll have a chance to get that with this with the vanguard one i haven't seen the crucible yet but i've heard that it's just complete like what is it 10 matches or something like that ridiculous and i don't even want to know what the gambit one is i i i sh i i will now never get this i will never know and then the raid one, raid slash dungeon, I wanna get this because I can do a dungeon, but the raids are a different story. So I just would recommend Vanguard. Vanguard's gonna be the most simple one. If you wanna switch it up, uh, Crucible, if you like Crucible or Destination, if you wanna do Destination, uh, she's gonna be selling random armor each week with different roles. These are all dog shit, but if you don't have this armor, then it, this is gonna be a great way for you to get armor that you don't have. Uh, not only that, we already knew that she was going to have armor pieces because Banshee did had them before. But that's pretty much it. Once you have 150, you're going to go here and just slam it in there and then you'll be good. So once you have your material, you're going to want to go to this menu and drop down to the appearance customization. And you'll get to this menu, which I love the UI. I love everything about this. The only thing I hate is the fact that like... The material is just ridiculous so if you guys see right here 
the blue ones for hunters, titans, and warlocks, obviously. And then Where synth weave template. Tool? It's really cool because, like, let's say I want to put this, uh, let's say, this shader on right now. I can actually just apply all. And where is it? so I would just click it. And it's just 2,500 glimmer, which is really cool. And then all of the armor is uh, done. I would love an extra button, like right here, like a few extra buttons where it's like apply to everything, like your weapons, your like everything. That would be really cool, but one step at a time. And from here on out, you can do whatever you really want, actually. Me do that so I can see. Okay. So you can pretty much do anything you want from here. Uh, whatever armor you've acquired over the years, you can actually just transmog that shit now, which is really cool. Like, I'm definitely gonna get this one. I'm definitely gonna get a few of them. The only kind of issue is the fact that you have to basically Maybe not regret your decision. I currently no. have a few pieces where I'm just like, yeah, I'm not gonna regret this at all, fam, because I love these pieces to death. Like, I have a chest piece, an arm, and a helmet that I've already transmogged, which is why I only have uh, that amount. I should have 11, but again, I've used a, a few of them. And this is how I think the first the the first seasons i'm gonna do it is just pick pieces that i really like and then after that go for armor sets because I, there's a bunch of helmets from here that i would just immediately get because i just love them so even like this one this one with uh no not this helmet there's one that that looks really cool with this uh this hood and i was like i want that so bad i think it was this one actually but it's just unfortunate like i said but we'll talk about that in the next video so again uh i love this it's really cool the system that they implemented is really cool just unfortunate that they wanted to monetize it when they could have just been like here this is just something you guys are gonna have because you know why would we monetize it we don't want to be assholes but yeah so let me know your thoughts in the comments below i i love transmog i just don't like this iteration of it because it's uh it's scummy as fuck but yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you guys want to follow me on my social media, all the links are in the description below. I thank you all for coming to this point, and I will see you guys later. When the traveler acts, the world changes. For some, it gets